Has your business profile for Google Local been suspended? Well, this video, I'm going to talk about one of the reasons why it gets suspended and what to do about it. So there's many different reasons why a Google business profile does get suspended, but one of them is issues with spam on an email account that owns or manages the profile. So how you can tell that you have this particular type of issue with your Google local profile is you're gonna get an email in the account from Google stating that there's been some suspicious activity on that particular email related to spam or something that happened with that email. And then right after you get that email around the same time, your Google profile is gonna get suspended. So that's how you know it's correlated to email. Now, if it if you don't get that email in your and it's suspend you just get the suspension, but you don't get the email about user violations related to that particular email, you know it's some other thing that's happened. But in this video, I'm going to tell you how to rectify, how to fix a Google business profile that's been suspended because of email specifically. Okay, so first of all, we need to identify that's what happened and which email it was that happened to. So then we can go to google.com forward slash business, log into our profile, and what we're going to do is we need to remove the email that is the offender, right? The one that's causing the issues because you can, you won't be able to get the profile back up until that email has been removed and replaced with a different email. So these are the steps that you need to do is go to log into your profile and it's going to show, it's going to show a message at the top that your profile is not being shown to the public right now. It's been suspended. Basically there's three little dots on the right hand side, right next to that message. Click those three little dots. And the very first option is business profile settings. Click on that. And then it is users and access. So click on users and access and then you can see all the different accounts that have access now if that email is just a manager or it, it you know it's not as an owner but not the primary owner you can just remove it very easily and you're good to go you've gotten rid of the bad account now if it's the primary owner that you're gonna have to follow these steps and it's a little bit more work that you're gonna have to do first of all if you just have that primary owner that's the email that's the offender you're gonna need to add another email address so if you have a different Gmail account add that on now as an owner and it's going to send you a notice to that email account. You have to log into the email account and accept the profile so that you're now become an owner of it. Okay. And then you have to wait seven days. So it takes seven days for it to actually op open up this option where you then can change and take off the primary owner. You're going to go back after seven days, take off the primary owner, and then you can switch it and make that new email you added as the primary owner and get rid of that other one. So that's a little bit of a process. So you have to get rid of the bad offending email, the one that's caused all the spam or whatever violation that Google is saying. You may not know what the violation is, but you got that notice. You know it's a bad actor and that's what caused your profile to get suspended. You gotta get rid of that email. So that's this is the process. And if it's the primary, it's gonna take seven days. So just know that. But if you need help with all this, and you want a little bit, um, you know, you need an assistance getting your profile up. We get lots and lots of profiles up. We've done probably close to 20 so far this year, getting profiles up. Comment down below if your profile is suspended. I would love to help you out. I have a lot of videos about Google business profile suspensions. You may want to watch some of my, my other videos uh, about it, but definitely comment down below if you need help. My name is Joe Phil with Skypoint Studios. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I'm gonna catch you on the next one.